Okay, guys, good morning. Happy Friday. Friday, July 17th. And we're going to go through some specials today. So, as I say pretty much every week, check out rnl.com. Today they have an 8-band OPEC HVT400B. This is a tap antenna. I ran one of these for a while on my truck, although I think it was an off-brand. But you tap this wire here for different bands, and they say it's 8-band HF and VHF. So it's uh, 80 meters, 40 meters, 20 meters, 15, 10, 6, 2, and 70 centimeters. Oh, the one I had didn't have VHF and UHF. In fact, the one I had, I think, only went to 10 meters. There's different designs of this. OPEC is a decent brand as well. I did run some OPEC antennas in other locations. I had a dual band OPEC antenna on my truck for a while. I was really happy with it. Never had their tap antenna, but... Uh, yeah, for uh, fifty four ninety five, that's not bad. So if you've got antenna restrictions or don't want to pay for a big screwdriver antenna, that might be a good option for you. Scrolling down on RNL.com, he's still got basically the same stuff he's had for the last few weeks. These 200-watt folding solar panels, two different versions of the Nano VNA, the Jetstream base station dual-band antenna, and the MMDVM kit. Fifty nine ninety nine. Those are, those have been there for a few weeks now. I assume they're probably selling well. That's why he's keeping them up there on the front page. Once again, this daily special changes every day. So this is the Friday special. Tomorrow to be something different. I'm gonna head over here to an email I received from Radiodity this week. They have a ten percent off summer sale, using the code of summer all caps. I don't know if it's case sensitive or not. says enjoy 10% off site wide until this Sunday I received this email three days ago so I think it was Tuesday of course my shopping videos don't come out until Friday so I couldn't share it until today but if you're not on Radio Oddity's email list it might be a good time to sign up you would have known this about this already so they got a GD 77 for about uh, for, well 10% off makes it $80.99 this Radio Oddity GS 5B is $89.99 with the code I've been using mine after I did my review video a few weeks ago. I've been pretty darn happy with it. It's easy to program from the front panel. It works well. I like the antenna. It's micro USB chargeable. And I think that's a really great thing to have if you're going to take a radio on a road trip or a fishing trip. I took it fishing with me a couple weeks ago. And uh, I was real happy with it. So this has been working out really well for me. I've been actually carrying it and using it. This RD5R is a one of their first dual band DMR radios. It works, but you can find better options for dual band DMR in my opinion. It does work though. The screen on it is quite small for a DMR radio. And I don't think it has any FPP capabilities. But there it is. Some people use it and like it. Great. Uh, this is not the original one they came out with that was a uh, single time slot only and would bleed over into the second time slot. That's another model. They discontinued that model. I think it was called a DM5R. They don't make that model anymore. This one right here worked pretty well on my own backyard repeater. And I have a video on that as well. You can go check my channel. The RD, I'm sorry, the GD73 is also a micro USB programmable. It is mono band. I'm sorry, micro U well, micro USB programmable and micro USB chargeable, both. <laughs> I meant to say chargeable. It is a monoband. You got 10% off, making it $72 right now. So those are good. If we, if we just click in here somewhere, it opens up their website. And it takes you to this uh, Radiodity PAX 100 100-watt 100 amp that's made for a QRP radio that they announced earlier this week. And I've emailed them to request to review one. We'll see if that works out. Made for the uh, Z it's basically made for the Zygu radios, the G90 and the X5105. So you can see some other pieces they have here. <laughs> There's a bunch of videos of talking about their stuff. There's me right there, GD73, Mr. Dave Kastler. He makes some good videos reviewing their equipment. So, radioddity.com. Again, all these 
Links will be in the description below, as I do every week. Weekly specials this week from Gigaparts. They got a large shipment of this Messi and Poloni coax in last week. Maybe a couple weeks ago now. And they've been in communication with me. And they're going to let me review some of it. 660, 656 feet. Woo! But, uh, <laughs> crazy. But this is like high, high, high quality coax uh, made by, uh, I'm probably saying their name wrong, Mezzi and Poloni. They're over in Italy. So it's Italian made, imported into the USA. Gigaparts is not the only distributor of it, I don't think, but they're one of the few. It's kind of hard to find the stuff sometimes. But it is ultra high quality coax. So if you're wanting a base station done right, I recommend this stuff. In fact, I'm probably going to be putting some of it in my shack build. I've been working on a few new videos for the shack build out that you will see upcoming. Also, Rig Expert has a couple of, or three new models of antenna analyzers coming out that they're calling the green line, I guess because they're the color green. Uh, Zoom Analyzer uh, AA650, AA1500, and AA2000. I think the difference between them is that they cover different bands. But these will be available in November of 2020. So a few months from now, this one goes up to 650 megahertz. That's probably why it's called the 650. So that'll cover 75, 85% of everything you need because it's all HF. Six meters, two meters, 220, 440. And this one probably goes to 1500 megahertz. Oh, what do you know? I was right. So those of you measuring... Um, some of the microwave stuff, 900 megahertz, 1.2 gigahertz, might find that a little bit more useful. And the other one will go up to probably 2,000. Is it 2,000? Yeah, 2,000. It's too bad it doesn't go to 3,000. You could use, your, use it to measure your 2.4 gigahertz routers, uh, which include home Wi-Fi and mesh networking. But these are on pre-order at Gigaparts. Again, they will be available November of this year. I'm going to head over here overseas to our friends at moonraker.eu for all of the folks in the European Union and those of you also in the UK, which is not part of the European Union anymore. <laughs> so, as promised on this channel a few episode, a few Friday episodes ago, uh, the R-Finder B1 is... Available at moonraker.eu. And this is, I believe, at this point in time, it is the only dealer in the UK. I'm sorry, in the European Union to be shipping direct. You know, you can order from rfinder.net, of course, and ship worldwide. But if you're in the European Union, Union, this is the probably the easiest way to do it because the currency exchange is the same, and you don't have to worry. The shipping time is probably quicker. So he's got the accessories over here as well. Moonraker.eu for the R Finder B1. I am told by Bob from R Finder that they are selling well, and they're talking about placing a second bulk order already. So that's a great. It's great to see the R Finder being used because I really enjoy mine. They've got other stuff over here at Moonraker. GB2500 all band HF antenna. Anytone 878. It's your Anytone DMR dealer for the European U Union. Shakespeare dealer. He still got the 857 in stock. This radio was discontinued by Yezu in the United States. Uh, I don't know, a while back, a month or two ago. So I don't know if they're making it for the EU still, or if Moonraker just hasn't sold out of their current inventory yet. 
Either way, if you want an 857, you better act now because these will be gone soon. That's neat. Enrico T320 4G Wi-Fi network radio. Fun times. So he's got a lot of other stuff down here. Anyway, moonraker.eu for folks overseas in the European Union. By Two Way Radios has a bunch of professional and commercial sales going on. Put up this website. Commercial rebate by 10 or more of the CP200 Delta. Nope, don't, don't move away. Get an additional rebate for every radio after 10. By 10, get up to a $400 rebate. So if you're in the commercial industry or use these for something specific, this is a commercial solution. He's got a whole line of Motorola commercial radios here. Social distancing solutions. I wonder what that is. Well, these are kind of like how-to documents or videos. Oh, yeah, so it's kind of like a blog post, and he's got sales stuff over here on the side. That's kind of fun. Might be some good information in there. Of course, he's got amateur, he's got ham radios, and he lumps his 11-meter CBs into it as well. Pretty good line of stuff. Some of the stuff he has, I can't get anywhere else. And like this uh, UV980 that I reviewed a while back. He's one of the few places that actually carries it. That's a pretty solid mobile radio, really. And these um, Oshang KGUV N1 dual band DMR HTs, one of the few places you can get that. Plenty of uh, different stuff in here. <laughs> Galaxy. Galaxy 10 meter, 10, quote, 10 meter, end quote. Oh, there's an icon. Oh, oh, that's a marine radio, I believe. Or a military. That's why it's so expensive. So buy two way radios.com for ham radios. He sells a line of FRS radios as well. FRS and GMRS. So if you have your GMRS license, I did a review of some FRS radios back a couple weeks ago from Radioddity, and I've got some of these FRS GMRS radios that By Two Way Radios was gracious enough to send me that we'll, you will see in an upcoming video as well. Going to be doing some more reviews of radios outside of amateur radio just for two way radio communications. So he's got a full line of FRS and GMRS walkie talkies. A couple of mobile. There's a. Midland GMRS 2A mobile radio rather than having a handheld. So good deal. Moving over into the gear for the common amateur radio operator. This is Josh KI6NAZ's new newish. It's been out for like a month. Hamtactical.com. He has all kinds of goodies here. For his YouTube channel, which is, of course, Ham Radio Crash Course. I'm actually going to be placing an order myself and wearing some of this on my own show. I can't wear the technician, the extra shirt yet. I can wear the technician. I can't wear the Fang Gang. Yeah, I'm probably going to get that one. <laughs> uh, general, hey, I can wear that shirt. Awesome. I might get a general shirt. I'll get a tumbler. And, uh, oh, he's got a woman. Oh, that's kind of neat. Definitely going to get a beer mug from him. No question about that. <laughs> awesome. At hamtactical.com, those of you who support Ham Radio Crash Course, this does go to support his channel. As all merchandise sales go for all of these channels around here. Uh, pint glass. Oh, yeah, that's the, probably the one I'll get, actually. There's his goofy face. And uh, Instagram, Twitter, a bunch of links down here at the bottom of the page. So hamtactical.com, head over there. If you buy stuff from him, be sure and tell him I sent you over there that you saw this on my Friday shopping video. It'd be fun. In fact, that goes for all these guys. If you buy anything from RNL, Radiodity, 
Gigaparts. Moonraker. I don't even know if Moonraker knows who I am, quite frankly. I just found them. Buy two-way radios. Ham Tactical. Just make sure, if, if you buy anything, just say, hey, by the way, I found your information, or I'm, I'm coming here because I saw you on Ham Radio 2.0 Friday Shopping video. Last but not least, my own website, very similar to Josh's. Uh, he does his for his own channel. I do mine for my own channel, but I've expanded mine a bit to include, and I actually put up some new shirts. Well, I've got some, uh, some other of the guys who've given me their designs and selling shirts for other YouTube channels besides mine. DS Commander has been probably the most popular shirt so far. This week, I put up the new emoji shirt, Ham Radio. This is the actual shirt, what it looks like. That's not a very good picture at all. <laughs> I got to change that. But I have that shirt, and I wore it yesterday. Uh, in fact, I wore it in an interview yesterday for a video you'll see upcoming next week. And I've got some new shirts in here for Sterling and Zero SSC. Get them in green or red, either one. Kind of a neat coffee cup. And if you look, that is his call sign spelled out in Morse code. N Zero SSC. So, plenty of... If you see it uh, also on my website, if you see... If you do a drop down on any of these shirts and you don't see the size you need... Some of them I have that go up to 3X. Others, others, some only go up to 2X. Some go up to 3X and some go up to 4X. I can get any shirt in any size. So please contact me. It's an extra step to put all the sizes and all the shirts. But that's, you know, I'm certainly willing to do it if people are interested in those. I have my own pint glass. Which you see me using on the show quite a lot. And different stuff like that. So those are your Friday specials for July 17th, guys. Thanks for watching. Catch us this coming Sunday uh, for my regularly scheduled every other or every first and third Sunday live stream. I will be welcoming Kyle AA0Z, and we will be talking about All Star. So if you're watching this video after the fact, after this weekend, go back and look. You can watch the live stream on a replay. Talk about some all-star, set up a node, get people to connect, and do some QSOs over the air. And over YouTube, both. 73 to all, and everyone have a good weekend.